All right, this is New Hampshire Cross Country powered by Runner's Alley coming at you from the 2023 Meet of Champions, today's Meet Hub by Arthur Thomas Properties. We are with the 2023 New Hampshire State Champs Oyster River. Girls, how exciting, how excited are you that you just won like everything in New Hampshire? Yeah. All right, hey, introduce yourselves. We got a couple of special guest stars here today too, so go ahead. I'm Tolia Bonifato, I'm a senior. I'm Haley Kazanson, I'm a freshman. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm Mackenzie Cook, I'm a junior, and this is Jethro Cook, he's a dog. <laughs> I'm Jerry Hool and I'm a sophomore. I'm Neely Roy, I'm a sophomore. This is Myrtle. Is she, <laughs> is she Myrtle, like it, it, she, I don't know, has her own Instagram page? Yes. What is it? What's the handle? Go ahead. Myrtle the Starbelly Sneech. Okay. Oh. Drop the follow. Drop the follow. Uh, I'm Madeline Cook and I'm a freshman. I'm Haley Cavanaugh. So ladies, you, you start off the season right out of the right out of the blocks, not track, but right out of the blocks as number one in New Hampshire and you just finished as number one in New Hampshire. How does that feel? Someone talk a little bit more to this. Senior, junior, someone. Was this your goal? Did you realize that you could do this at the beginning of the year? Yeah, I think we all knew that we had a good chance to have a really good season. I don't, I don't think any of us came in thinking that we were gonna be undefeated in New Hampshire for the entire time, but yeah. it feels amazing, especially yeah. as it's my last season as a New Hampshire. That's gotta feel pretty good, doesn't it? Yeah, definitely. Yeah. So what was more responsible for this for today? Was it Myrtle or was it the dog? <laughs> Jethro. Yeah, Jethro? Yeah, Jethro? I had an injury one time, I named it Jethro. I'm not kidding. It's not about me. But hey, so um, going into next week, well, let's go, let's go back to this race first. How do you like this course versus Dairy Field? It's fast. Yeah, yeah it's fast. Sneaky hills. Listen to Neely, Sneaky Hills. So if you could choose which course to run on, which one would it be, Dairy Field or this course? Dairy Raise your hand for Dairy Field. Although this course is pretty true cross country. There's no pavement on this course. And then looking at next week, can we, do we even talk about next week yet, or do we just like really enjoy today? Um, Say really enjoy today. Yeah. <laughs> what was the biggest challenge? Was it the expectations coming in? Was it the actual course? Was it the c competition, which obviously was a little bit more than last week? Obviously, Hanover gave you a run, but this week coming in a lot more. What was more of a more of a challenge this week? Um, I think the team like Pinkerton we had chasing us and Hanover and. We knew would be after us. Yeah. yeah. Target on your back. You felt the heat? Oh, come on. <laughs> hey, congratulations. Looking into next week, what are you guys thinking? Have you What What, have, what does the coaches tell you about Belfast course? What kind of course it is? Yeah. It's, it has bells and it's fast. Is that what you said? Okay. Um, last question. What's our fun question today? You guys get to pick it. Madam's been doing all the talking. Neely has Myrtle. Yeah. <laughs> what's the what's the fun question today? Uh, <laughs> Would you rather run in 95 degree heat or 40 degrees in rain? 40 degrees. Well, that's not that. 95 degrees, Neely. All right. All right. What about what about shout outs for today? Let's start with Haley this time. She's like, I thought I had time to think. <laughs> Haley, you gotta speak up. I can't hear you. <laughs> <laughs> Who else wants to go? Uh, coaches, teammates, parents, yeah. Myrtle, Jethro. Anybody else? Did you thank your parents? Did you thank your coaches? Yeah. Okay. All right, hey, girls, congratulations. We'll be looking forward to seeing you guys represent New Hampshire next week up in Maine. And uh, yeah, congrats. Thank you.